Yo guys, my name is Bossman Sam, uh, and today we're going to be going over how to make custom fire and ramps, just like these ones here showed in the video. Um, but basically, uh, the first thing that we're going to want to do is go to my Discord server, which is here. Um, I'll leave the link in the comments and the description, just in case you need, uh, in case you need either of them. Um, but you're going to go to resources once you're verified, uh, and the things that you're going to need is you're going to need Open IV, Photoshop. And the reflective ramps templates, which you can find here. Now, I've already got them downloaded, as you can see. Uh, I'm going to download them again, because why not? Um, but if, you're in the, if you need to know how to set up OpenIV, go to my last video, and there's a whole tutorial on that. Uh, it's the clothing tutorial, but you can figure out how to do OpenIV from that. Um, but yeah, once you've done that, you're going to open your OpenIV Windows. And you're going to go to uh, where you want your ramps to be. So mine's just in the ramps folder. Ramps. Uh, I'm going to... I've already got this made. But you want to make a new... Actually, I'll do it again. You want to make a new uh, folder. Let me, let me close out of this real quick. Uh, no. And... No. There we go. Um, but yeah. Uh, you need to open... You need to make a new folder. So I don't know why that's happening. Because... I've closed out of it everywhere, but it's fine. We'll make a new one. Uh, new folder, video, reflect. Um, so you can call it whatever you want, it doesn't really matter. But you get that. Uh, you're going to drag in the RPF that we've just downloaded. I'm just going to rename it quickly to remove the one, just because it's annoying me. Uh, but you open that. Now, this discord.ggol.txt, this is the original guy who made the template, so shout out to him. Um, <coughs> but yeah, you open, you open content. The, the other RPF, X64, RPF. And you're going to open this YTD, not the high YTD, so the normal one. Then you're going to go to the bottom one, export, selected, PNG. Make sure you're saving it to the right one. Mine's video reflex ramps, PNG, save. You're going to get this one, uh, which is just literally just the one above it. Export, selected, PNG, and then save. And that's just the two that we need. This one's the pattern, this one's for the text. So you press save, or not not text, or just overlays or text, it's up to you. Um, but once that's done, you open your Photoshop, you're going to go file, open, you're going to go to the one, the file that we've just made, video reflect ramps, you're going to open the pattern PNG. Now you need to find an image that you like, now I already have this one, um, you press copy image or just save it, it's up to you. Uh, I'm going to flip it to make sure it's the right uh, size, there we go, make it a bit bigger, make sure it fits. Just like that, there we go. We go file, save as, save on your computer, PNG, and just save, and then press yes. There we go. Then you press file, open, you're going to get this one. Now this is for the text or overlays, it's up to you. I'm just going to get like an overlay, so I'll say purple heart PNG. So let's just say this, this looks pretty cool. Uh, we're going to get that copy image, paste it here. I'm going to erase the background, give it a cool little uh, stroke and maybe an outer glow too, that would be cool. Now, you need to make sure it's somewhere in this area over here, uh, because I don't know why, but over here it just doesn't really work properly. This is the bottom right corner of the ramp, I believe. Uh, so you're going to save that, file, save as, save on your computer, PNG, uh, and save it there, just like that. Now, we're going to go back to OpenIV. We're going to open this YTD, press on the bottom one, replace it with the one that we just made, which is this one. Go on the one above it, replace it with the one that we just made again, which is this one. Press save, and now go back, back again, 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 again. Uh, one more time. Wait, no, sorry, go forget that last one, but you know what I mean. Uh, we've got this RPF here, so with that there, we're going to go back to our desktop, right click fire then. Open file location, five minute application data, mods. Uh, make sure you delete whatever ramps are in there already, otherwise it won't work properly. You're gonna open your OpenRV and drag this RPF into that folder there. Now you can go ahead and load into your server and your RAMs will be ready if you just go ahead and open. Sorry about that, the video cut off, but um you open your 5M, you load into your server. Um I'll give it a chance. Also, um a quick tip, it's got nothing to do with the ramps, but a quick tip if you do want to turn off loading screen music because it gets annoying or you're trying to film a video and you don't want to get copyrighted, stuff along those lines. You want to press Windows G, 
and there's uh, you want to scroll down on this part to five and chrome browser turn it all the way down and that's pretty much just removes the load so you've still got it removes the loading screen music but you've still got um the the other sounds which is here uh but yeah if you close out of that just give it a chance to load the server loading quickly there we go as you can see it's worked they look pretty cool we've got um some cool ramps here uh, the heart that i put on will be over here i believe it'll be yep yeah, there it is cool little purple heart but yeah that's how you make 5m uh, reflective ramps if this did help please feel free to drop a like and subscribe uh, but yeah with that being said thanks for watching and have a good day